Hello and welcome back to Celebrity Big Brother. Now, they've had their suspicions, but four days in and our 10 celebrities are still kind of debating whether there's an imposter in their midst. But tonight, Chantelle's mission to pretend to be a celebrity comes to a dramatic end. Now in 15 minutes, Big Brother will give the housemates a task. And if Chantelle passes it, she stays and becomes a celebrity. But if she fails, she'll be unceremoniously booted out and whisked back to uh, Essex. No crowd, nothing. But first, it's time for your last instalment of yesterday's shit. So, <laughs> I need to put my teeth in, hold on of yesterday's celebrity shenanigans huh? in what could be Chantal's last full day in the house, bless her. And Faria has committed the ultimate sin, too much cooking and cleaning. Oh, for God's sake, Faria. Ten thirty-two pm Some of the housemates are in the living room. Yeah, you know who's trying to play there, a real smart yeah. game here? Who? The, what's her name? Faria. Marilla? No, for no. For she's playing as what? Do you notice what she's doing? She's always right there, cooking, cleaning, mm -hmm. always coming in, talking, not saying too much, just being buddy buddies. But she's always cooking and cleaning, always. I see. I see what you're saying, but also she can throw down. Yeah, exactly. She can cook you know, her ass off. She's a great stuff. cook, and and she knows yeah, that, and she likes to. But I see what you're saying, but it's still a game, and. In the end, we're, only one of us is going to win, so we're all getting eliminated except for one of us. So, George, Michael, and Rula are at the seating area. So you're not that, having um, the, the strange thing of you have the choice to get to know, to a certain degree, each individual. Even the little girl, uh, Chantal, I, I actually didn't believe she was a pop star. I thought there's something funny here. I think this is a. Uh, I still don't believe it. Only because there was a constant turning the back, her back to the audience, which I found so oh, strange. Geez, I mean, she did, she did come to life in a way that I hadn't seen before. Mm. But um, well, my my problem was, she told me a ranking in the charts, and she told somebody else a completely different ranking. And uh -huh. I thought, because you know, if you're not telling the truth, you, it's very hard to remember the lies that you told everyone. So I, I began to get suspicious, unworthily. But uh, do you think the ultimate difference is if you're coming in here to prove something to other people rather well, than just being yourself? And it's well, very hard. Everybody says just well, be yourself. Well, yes, but we're all doing a mixture of both. Some of us have more need than others. Yeah, but I, I mean... Some of us have a more desperate need than others. Yeah. A real agenda to clear up. Yeah, well, I don't myself. What, what, whatever. But I don't. It, uh, I yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I mean, I, 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 can I speak for yourself? It's, it's impossible to think if I do this, this, and this, 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 and this. What happen? You do what you do, and that's it. <laughs> Eleven forty-three p.m. Some of the housemates are in the spa. Michael, Maggot and George are in the living room. Does Pete have breasts? The thing is, I don't think he no, has got he, proper he, breasts. He insists that he's not trying to be a woman, but I'm sure he's got breasts. No, isn't he, he's, isn't he's, he's just got interest. normal chest? He's just, he's just fit. No, I thought he'd had the operation when I first came in. But he hasn't. Pick a few you two, aren't you? <laughs> Telling me. Oh, you want to get out more. Preston is in the diary room. How did your performance go earlier today? I was really nervous, actually, to be honest. It was, uh, no, it's good. I, the whole thing was actually, I was sort of dreading it, but uh, it was really good. It was like, uh, it was proper fun, actually. What did you think of the other housemates' performances? Uh, I thought Pete was amazing. Uh, I thought Ruler was amazing. I really enjoyed that. I thought Michael was a bit mental. He's fucking mental though, isn't he? But um, I was a bit scared, to be honest. I thought it was just everything suddenly got a little bit surreal. And uh, I felt a bit detached. I was just like, what is going on? Michael Barrymore's just gone completely mental. But it's an everyday experience for me to be uh, sitting one of 
10 in an audience watching Michael Barrymore do impressions of Adolf Hitler. I'm still, I still don't feel like I've worked everyone out completely. Maybe I, I was a bit, I was really suspicious of uh, Chantel. I don't know why, just because I thought that like, a lot of things didn't add up for me. And uh, I, thought, I was thinking, like, oh, mate, well, maybe she, her band isn't real. And uh, you've sent her, you've put her in here to, so that we, to, to try and pretend that she's a celebrity. And, um, do you know what I mean? And, uh, and, sh and then, you know, she's just an actress or whatever. But I'm over that anyway now, so it's all right. OK, welcome back to Celebrity Big Brother, where for four days, promo girl Chantal has been hobnobbing with the stars, impersonating pop star from a fictional girl band. Um, but this is where things get serious. Now, Big Brother is about to set a task, and the housemates must rate themselves in order of fame. Now, if they consider Chantal to be the least famous person in the house, she will have failed her secret mission and will be leaving tonight. If she's not the lowest, then she stays. Over to Big Brother. For a guy, if a guy could take a couple ribs right here, he can actually do it. Give it hell, man. You've been with yeah. a woman who just took yeah. ribs out yeah. and had sex with her. I said, a man. With George, open the envelope and read the past instructions of now the rest of the group. Tracy, you have been eliminated. Go home, bitch. You have been eliminated. Go home, bitch. I'll go right to Vivian Westwood. You're black and male. These got the runs? <clears throat> what? It's okay. Housemates, today's task is for a very, very, very special reward. Ooh. I hope it's a while. In the garden are 11 podiums numbered 1 to 11. As a group, Housemates must rank themselves in order of fame. Oh. The housemate the group thinks is the most famous should be ranked at number one and must stand on podium number one. The housemate the group thinks to be the second most famous should be ranked at number two and must stand on podium two, and so on. To clarify, the housemate stood on podium one is the most famous and the housemate on podium 11 is the least. Housemates must decide among themselves which podium each housemate must stand on. Housemates must not start the task or discuss it in any way until Big Brother sounds a klaxon. Housemates will have a maximum of two minutes to complete the task. Big Brother will sound a second klaxon when the two minutes is up or when all the housemates are stood in their final order on the podiums. To clarify, if housemates order themselves before the two minutes is up, Big Brother will sound the second klaxon. Rules. Only one housemate is permitted to stand on a podium. To clarify, there must be no joint positioning. All housemates must be stood on an individual podium at the end of the task. Housemates must complete the task within two minutes from the sound of the first klaxon. Housemates must decide the final order solely as a result of their discussions in relation to how famous they think they are. Housemates must not use age, height, alphabetical order, or any other device to decide the ordering. <coughs> Big Brother would like to remind housemates that all tasks are compulsory. Signed, Big Brother. So we can't start discussing <clears throat> until the first until klaxon. Until the first klaxon. Okay, and then we have two minutes. Maximum two minutes. And how, I think you ought to be in charge. Since this is Big Brother. <laughs> Housemates must now place themselves in order of fame. Okay. Well, <laughs> Michael Barrymore well is number one. Well, no, number Dennis, one. And Tracy. Dennis. Dennis and Tracy are number one and two. Without oh my God. That's absolute rubbish. No. Yeah. They're American that's, and they're That's poor. absolute they're rubbish. No, no, no. This is a British. Yeah. Yeah. This is, this is a British She's television not. show. Yeah, this, this is simply not true. No, no. This is. This is. 
This is a British television show. Oh, no, but it's, it's your... It's well, English, then you guys are... Yeah, I think we're England, Barrymore, number one. Yeah, but Barrymore, Michael. Don't you want to play? It's just doesn't matter. Just get on a plane. 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 Well, that's what you think. Yeah, I think Dennis is number two. <laughs> I think Dennis and Tracy are number one and two. Well, yeah, argue, no, argue, argue. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, who should be number three? Michael yeah, but I mean, look at, look at all the... What I nominations for number three? George, 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 you're in the top five, for sure. Should I be five? Pete. No, you're in the top five, for sure. Oh, we're going to have to suck in on it. We're going to have to suck in on it. This is Big Brother. You have one minute remaining. Come on, let's go. Right, so you're going to be one. Hold on, hold on. You just get on we're not even no, no, no. Wait, whatever. We're tired. We're tired. We're tired. We're tired. If we don't get it right this time, we'll get a chance to oh. do it right. This is Big Brother. Your time is up. Please remain on your podiums until instructed to get down by Big Brother. This is funny shit. <laughs> <laughs> I was literally screaming, Chantel is more famous than Preston and Maggot. It's official, she did it! Okay, I'm quite pleased about that. Okay, Chantel is now officially a celebrity. She can stay, she can win, she's arrived. Okay, I've spat. Time for Big Brother to share the good news with the house. I'm pretty sure there's something in there for us too. I think it should have been like glass. Are you kidding me? I should have been like glass. It's an interesting one, isn't it? Yeah, I'm, I'm like... It's a funny thing. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. No, you're aware! Are you aware? This is Big Brother. Would Chantel come to the diary room? I'm middle of that, so and I look down on him, but after him. Yeah. <laughs> I know this. Oh my god. What is going on? You are what? It's me. What the? Well, I'm. Hello, Chantal. Hello. As you know, you entered the Celebrity Big Brother house as a non-celebrity. Yeah. A nobody. Yeah. There is no such band as Candy Floss. I fucking said, didn't I? Yeah. The mole. I've been saying it since day one. Yeah. Since entering the house, you have been on a secret mission to earn celebrity status mm -hmm. and the right to stay in the Celebrity Big Brother house. Yeah. Your mission was to convince your fellow housemates that you are, in fact, a genuine celebrity. Yeah. Tonight, you convinced the rest of the house that you are more famous than Preston and Maggot. Therefore, you have passed your secret mission and are now a genuine celebrity. Wicked. You can stay. Brilliant. That's great. That's fantastic. I've passed my mission. Oh, God. Yeah. Fantastic. Congratulations. Thank you. Cheers. Uh -huh. How does it feel? Well done, mate. <laughs> I'm not exactly famous, am I? passed a secret mission, didn't I? <laughs> Do you think you will be accepted by your fellow celebrity housemates? Not if they're watching this right now, and I really hope they're not. Because I've had so much private. So if they are watching this now, then I hope they understand how, how much pressure I've had oh. put on me. Oh. And also, um, you know, they've, I hope they put themselves in my place. At, like you said, I, I was a nobody. And I hope um, all them people are 
I've got a feeling they're watching, um, and I hope they think back to a time when maybe they was a nobody, and if they, they had the chance that I've had, well, wow. they'd find it in themselves to think that they would have done exactly the same thing as me. Chantal, is this the last we have seen of Candy Floss? What do you mean? Would you consider releasing I Want It Right Now? <laughs> yeah, if they like put like a, put my voice over or something. <laughs> oh, I knew it from that song. That yeah, was that song. Is there anything you would like to say to your fans? <laughs> hiya. <laughs> Maybe. Hiya, yeah, just hiya. What fans, anyway? Chantal, in front of you is a pen and a piece of paper. Yeah. Can Big Brother have your autograph? Oh, shut up. Get up. You are taking the mic. Big Brother would like your autograph, Chantal. What for? But they're saying going down here, right, big time, and I haven't, got, I haven't got the faintest idea what it is. I really haven't. They're saying, they're saying big going down, and I haven't got the faintest idea what is, what, what is going on. Chantal, you have passed your secret mission and are now a genuine celebrity. Right, OK. Big Brother would like your autograph. <laughs> you are taking me. I haven't bloody got an autograph. <laughs> I haven't got an autograph. Would you like me to, um, would you like me to, uh, address it to you? Not that. Yes, please. OK. Two. Right, is this a trick? No, Big Brother would like your <laughs> First day we said trick. that. Yeah, we are. No, it isn't. OK. I'm going to trust you on that, right? I'm going to trust you. Two. Big. Brother. I'll put brothers. Oh, love. Chantel. There you go. Thank you, Chantel. You're welcome. Please enjoy the rest of your stay and the celebrity inauguration party that Big Brother has organised on your behalf. You are now free to leave the diary room. But hang on a minute, why are they going to... Why are they going to wonder why there's a party going on, aren't they? For me? The inauguration party is for you and your fellow housemates. But why is it for me, though? Chantelle, because you have passed your secret mission and are now a genuine celebrity. Yeah, but they're going to ask why, though. Why? Or oh, unless they've already wa they've been watching this. They have, ain't they? Yeah. I <laughs> know. Oh, I completely. Chantelle, you are now free to leave the diary. Oh, I've got some Chantelle. Yeah. You've changed. What do you mean? What my clothes? You are now free to leave the diary. Oh, I've changed what? You
Is it her song? Yeah. That's fucking that's I right can't. again, isn't it? That's it Oh shit! I've got a camera. I'm so, I'm so I'm really sorry. You were the main person I was worried about. I was blind. Look, shut up. Look, shut up. Look, walk a flame. You got to be honest in here. Oh my god. Put them in there, man. Oh my god. I don't believe this. Hold on. You've got to take a photo from here. Can I just say, right? Do you know what was really brilliant about that was that they were playing Candy Floss's single in the background. I want it right now. Chantal has passed her secret mission and left us with the very real possibility that a non-celebrity could win Celebrity Big Brother. It's brilliant, isn't it? OK, Big Brother's back at 9pm tomorrow night and I'll see you at the first eviction on Friday. Good night. If you had gone to number 11... No. Did you know that? Even what? Did you know that? I, I, do you know what? For the last goodness knows, since Thursday, I don't know. I haven't known nothing. Like people are saying to me, oh, so like, you know, wh where, where did you, you play? Yeah, where do you play? Big in Germany. What's, you used to say about your royalties. I went, well, what? <laughs> yeah, you went, your royalties? I'm, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you were always in the pole game. You know, I thought you was lying. I thought you was lying. I thought, no, 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 I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I knew I really you was. Yeah. Did you? Yesterday. But then I was saying, I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not I convinced you that against it, didn't I? Yeah, 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 to be honest, I thought you were after he said it. I would have still said you were the least famous out there, but I was just like, we were being humble and everything. Same, same, same. I know, like, massive, like, I'm, but, oh my god, she's like, you're big in Germany. I'm joking, but I'm sure, like, you know, when you're selling fucking Germany. She's going to recognise me from Brentwood from just like drinking out in places, and your brother, like, would know who I am, and he would know. Yeah, I don't know your brother. I was thinking, my brother doesn't know. Famous. I did think that when you were saying, I know your brother. I was thinking, yeah. you would have told me if he knew this girl in the film. Did you just see that then, when I was in the diary room? Do you want your autograph on that? Let's take it down. Oh my god, I'm going to leave it. Do your hands, do your hands. I want to ask you a question. Are you a vegetarian now? Yes, I am. You are, okay. I'm definitely a vegetarian. Do your hands, do your hands. Do your hands and look up.